of new Arsenal, the Arsenal of the 21st century. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Alexandre Lacazette. He really is a top-class striker, Peter. His movement's so sharp and instinctive, and his first touch is usually bang on, giving him the best possible opportunity of, of getting an effort away. He's not just a goal poacher, though. He puts in a, a good defensive shift, too, pressing the opposition high up the pitch. Well, quite no argument from me on that one. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready. It's Lacazette! Well, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. Hoists it forward. Tries to switch the play. He's got options out wide. Uh, more than happy to take the muscular approach. Partey. Oh, they can break here. Out to the right. In towards the middle. Tete tries to clear. Danger averted for now. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Ars and the finish! And the ball's come out! That's gone a long way up and away. He's in! Has a go! David Luiz tries to get it forward quickly. Look at the defender bombing forward. And he just whacks it away. The referee has given a corner. Massive leap! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Lamina. Lookman looking to get on the end of this. Towering header! Oh, just needed a better contact. Oh, that's a real disappointment as well after he worked so hard to just get into position and get on the end of that in the first place. A lot of effort for very little reward. And it's played forward. Now it's Mitrovic. Loftus cheek. And the counter is on. Done very well to intervene. Loftus cheek. Oh, he certainly caught him there. It's a free kick. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. Partey, no goals as yet. Saka goes looking. Bayerine gets wrestled off the ball. He's been bundled over, that is a foul.
He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. Lamina. Lookman. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Cedric Suarez. Partey. Partey gets it out to the wing. This is promising. Look at it! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. to meet it went with his head but couldn't steer it in the defense did very well to be able to close him down in numbers like that they basically suffocated his hopes shut a goal Loftus-Cheek. Well, if anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. Fulham ran themselves into the proverbial cul-de-sac there. And here's Lacazette. He's on his way. And it's Hector Bellerin. He's got it, and he's got time. And the shot! Tete gets good distance on it. Areola gets it upfield. Holding positions himself well and cuts it out. Loftus cheek. And helps available out wide. That's a brilliant interception. Granite Xhaka could move up a gear here. Uh, let down by a lack of accuracy. Keeper sends it forward. There's the whistle for half time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. So they head in no further forward. The score here still nil nil. And we are already promptly back on the way. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. Has a hit! That has certainly tested the keeper. Party simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Arsenal have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Goes to finish! And it's a goal! And some players are just capable of grabbing a game by the scruff of the neck, and his immense talent may just have done exactly that, and injected the belief that they can retain their lead this time round. Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Arsenal take the lead, 1-0. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. Finds himself eased off the ball. And it's Mitrovic. Mitrovic plays it out to the flank. A really good feat. Aimed in towards the centre. And here's Loftus. Goes for goal!
Partey looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Yeah, Peter, and it looks like this defence will go tooth and... It's Lacazette! He's done very well to get to that. Lacazette is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Heads it! And that's caused a worry or two. William did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Zambo and Gisa. Keeper's got good distance on that. Zambo and Gisa. Now it's Mitrovic. Played out to the right. He's picked him out. Has a pop! This could fall anywhere. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Well, I'm a believer in having faith in your ability, but he's overdone it then. William! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. William sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. And here's Aubameyang. Tete. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Peter, they're leaving nobody guessing now. This is a decisive attempt to go further in front. Fulham are enjoying lots of possession, but they just can't find any penetration. Forward it goes. And once more, they can't get through. Now that's a foul. A simple decision for the referee. Substitution for Arsenal. Number 17. Coming on to replace him is... Number 21. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. And here's Lacazette. Aubameyang. Shapes to shoot! Cleared away. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Chambers. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Lamina. 1-0 as we head towards the end. Gets the better of his man. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Now it's Mitrovic. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Well, Red, he sorted that out. Cleared without complication. Aubameyang is on to it and can take it up. A chance to play it in. Goes for goal! Oh, that's a fine save!
Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Fulham are making a change now. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Granit Xhaka. And it's a Bamiyang. Tries to get it forward quickly. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Mitrovic making use of the space out wide. And time is up. Arsenal hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. Yeah, it was a, a fairly stern test with very little between two teams that scrapped for everything.